All right, so Stevie Wong, um, generic. What's up? Um, so uh, do you remember the first time you guys ever saw Bill and Ted? Like how did that, how did Bill and Ted kind of like seep into your consciousness? I think it's always been there. I don't actually, I don't I remember, remember the first time differently. <laughs> that now that we've time traveled, yes, space and time is very different for us. No, it's just always, been, it's like, I've just always known these movies and the, you know, excellent the vernacular. Like, I, I, I don't know. It's just there. It's in me. I'm scared. <laughs> I don't remember the exact time. I just know that I watched it a lot. So it must have been like on TV, on HBO. I know I certainly saw them both in theaters. And then also every single time they were on TV. <laughs> we just, my, my brother and I, that's what we did with our childhood, was just watch TV. It's a different kind, different parenting. <laughs> Um, then, then to know that you're going to work on this, was there a little bit of um, trepidation or just kind of like anxiety to be part of something that is so loved um, by, by the fans? I wasn't anxious. I was just excited, honestly. Like, I was like, you know, this movie's not going to rest on my shoulders. Uh, so I was like, I can take a breath. <laughs> I could just go in, do the best I possibly can and have the most fun possible. You know, I knew it was going to be based on the other two. We knew it was going to be super fun. So, um, yeah. yeah. I was thrilled. I was like super, super excited. Maybe a tad bit anxious because these are such iconic films that it's like, oh, I hope people accept me as the princess. Um, I think I felt that a little bit. Um, what do you think it is about these, these these characters that make Bill and Ted so likable? What, what is it about them that that is so charming that people like adore them? I've always thought it was just, it's their like relentless optimism, you know, they're, they're so positive and that's infectious. Yeah, they're incredibly like, they're a lovable duo and it, you know, they it's true. They aren't, they, <laughs> they're not snarky, you know, there's no, yeah. there's, there's, there's nothing mean spirited in them at all. And it's nice to see. It's nice to see that it's comforting as a viewer. I think. Um, without any, without any spoilers, giving away any spoilers, are there any favorite lines from the film that like still makes you giggle? That either you guys said or like the boy said. Oh, uh, I don't know. I've been asked that quite. That's a good question. <laughs> it's in the trailer, so this isn't a cup. Is this is not a thing? But like when she goes, like in the in the therapy scene, when they're like, "Do you think this is what your wives had in mind?" and they're like, "Yo, work." Couples therapy, we're a couple of couples. Like, that, you know, laugh, like just that, that mentality that they wouldn't think that couples therapy is something they should just do with their spouse. Just the idea of that still kind of tickles me. Do you have any other, other spoiler kind of like lines that, that make you giggle? Oh, no, I, don't, oh, I can't think of anything off the top of my head. I mean, I was very excited to hear them say excellent, like, which is obviously not a spoiler. You're assuming that they're going to say it. But there's a moment where we all get to say it together. And I was like, I'm saying excellent with Bill and Ted. Like, it was a very, um, yeah, exciting moment for me. <laughs> Last question. If you can travel anywhere in time, where would it be and, and why? Getting good time travel questions. And no, this, I, you know, I think I would love to, this is like getting semi-serious for a second. I wish I could think of something funny, but I actually would like to meet like my ancestors that like moved over here and just like have a little chat. Like, why is it so bad over there? Where are you coming from? What's going on? You know? I love, I love, um, I love old pictures of what cities used to look like. You know, like looking at a picture of Pasadena when there's just one thing on the hill or, or New York, even though like back when there's everything is one story or two stories, you know, and there's carriages through the streets, although it'd probably be really stinky, you guys. Yeah. Um, the sewer systems were not up to snuff. But I would only want to do it if I could take like, like some aerial views and like <laughs> check everything out. That's weird. I have to be a bird. Can I be a bird? <laughs> Yeah, I think so. I think so, Aaron. You can be whatever you want to be. Oh my gosh, Gina, thank you. You're welcome. All right, that's it. <laughs> <laughs> we'll, we'll leave it at, on birds. Um, thank you, guys. That was that was really uh, hopefully pain painless. So that, yeah, thank you. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Well, thank you. Talk to you. Bye.